YouTube, what up? I just want to do one more shot of the system working before I got put my grill and stuff back on. But as you can see there, we got nice flowage. Uh, it's recirculating very well. It's been running 20 minutes or so, and this thing's not even warm yet. It's uh, keeping it nice and cool. Uh, basically, what it's doing is it's just a little bit above my full mark. And when it gets just about another eighth of an inch higher, it kind of forces its way and makes a flush and injects cool electrolyte to the bottom of the system there. Let's see if I can get down in there. That's where my negatives hooked up at the bottom and I got a, a quick connect valve down there uh, to recirculate the water. As you can see, I use nice big cables for my positive and my negative. Um, so, and I've got a little bit of wiring left to do. As you can see, I've got it right now. I've just got it going to my new power supply. Ooh, I love my power supply. It's been good to me. It runs it right about the same as what my truck would, about 20 amps. There are about, so. And uh, my last little part I have to do is uh, my, va my gas line that goes to uh, the motor. Um, I've, I've already got a spot tapped right here, um, but if does anybody have a preference or have or know where the best place should it go on this side of the sensor over here, or should it go on this side of the sensor over here? Uh, should it go way up over here close to the intake? I do know that the tip of it needs to be kind of cut at an angle so it helps create a vacuum, kind of like a point. A point. But uh, if anybody has any suggestions, input, feedback, anything over, well, got to put my switch to the ignition, uh, the obvious stuff, but uh, and maybe a fuse. But uh, anybody has any suggestions or whatever to uh, further this along and make it the best it can be, I would certainly appreciate it. And look at that. It's moving nice. Moving real nice. All right, guys. Thanks. Later.